quite the year for the space industry, from the first Artemis moon mission finally launching to Amazon earlier this year, setting a multi-billion dollar launch contract record for its Project Kuiper broadband constellation that's under development. I sat down earlier this month with Tori Bruno, the CEO of Rocket Maker United Launch Alliance, which is the Lockheed Martin Boeing JV that will carry a majority of those Amazon satellites to orbit, to discuss what's been a dramatic swing in the launch market this year from oversupply to capacity crunch. It's a dynamic Bruno expects to persist over the next decade. Between Kuiper, but not Kuiper alone, Starlink is also now the majority yeah. of SpaceX launches launching for themselves, really for their own constellation. These are the two big elements you see today, but there are several others. OneWeb is, is entering the marketplace. In the last three years, the licenses for spacecraft going to orbit to do this mission has tripled. And we're now looking at licenses for 50,000 objects in space. This is wow. huge. And that's just the beginning. The applications take that to 100,000. And there are people filing. It, it's gotten so crazy. There are countries filing just to grab the real estate. That wow. takes it to 500,000.